Hey everybody, Derek here from Badgerland Birding. Today I'm going to be talking about why Encanto should be a birder's favorite Disney movie. I actually got the chance to watch it on a flight not that long ago, and I was just kind of blown away by some of the things they added into it. Overall, I really enjoyed it as a movie. This is going to have slight spoilers, so just a warning if you uh, don't want to spoil any of the plot if you haven't seen it. Um, you know, maybe watch the movie first and then come back. But uh, we're just going to cover a tiny little bit of the plot. So the thing that really blew me away is that all the animals in the movie, including the birds, are real birds that you can find in Colombia. That's where Encanto takes place. And when I saw the Keel Build Toucan at first, that's when I was like, wow, that's a real Keel Build Toucan. And then I saw the Yellow Throated Toucan, and I was like, these are real birds that live in Colombia. And so I give real credit to the people that made those decisions to use the real animals. Sometimes in movies you'll get just a bird, it's kind of just a blanket bird or animal looking thing that um, they throw in there. We need a bird, we'll just put you know a yellow bird in there. It's not representative of any real animal, but they actually went out of their way to make these Colombian animals in the movie. So I pulled up a picture of Antonio, one of the characters with all his animals here. And so we're gonna go through the individual birds and talk about what species they actually represent. So I have it pulled up here, so I'll pull it up on the screen as well. So here we have Antonio, and in his left hand, he has a keel-billed toucan, which I actually got to see in Costa Rica, which is very awesome to see them then. And then we have a channel build toucan right here uh, next to his right arm. He's riding a jaguar. And then we have the yellow throated toucan sitting on a mountain tapir, which is also a specific Colombian species. We have South American coatis depicted here as well, and then capybaras. One of my favorite scenes in the movie is actually one of the capybaras just being goofy. And then we have a toco toucan as well. There's also a couple different hummingbirds. These are a little harder to tell what specific species they are because there's so many different hummingbirds that live in Colombia and uh, South America in general. Someone on Twitter thought that this one right here may be a purple-throated wood star, which uh, I looked it up and I, I think that that probably is what that is. These are a little harder to tell, um, but they're definitely probably species that also you can find in Colombia. It was kind of difficult to find really specific information on who made these decisions, um, but I really give them credit for taking the extra time to do that, and I think bird lovers, nature lovers in general will notice that like I did, and it'll make them like the movie more. So props to them for doing that. If you guys have seen the movie, what did you think about the animation, or just over in the movie overall, what did you think about it? Uh, let me know in the comments below. And I thought it was really neat, just wanted to point it out to you guys. Uh, thanks so much for watching. If you like what we do, please hit the subscribe button uh, and the notification bell and uh, share with your friends as well. So thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time on Badgerland Birding.